Welcome to this uh, Windows Computer and Technology channel. And of course, uh, with the latest uh, bug fixing update, all features of the new Moment 4 should be turned on for most people. Um, and of course, the File Explorer has one new feature. It can now not only open up zip archives, it can actually open up 11 new types of archived uh, files, and they are the ones that you see here, .rar, .7zip, or 7z, uh, .tar, .tar, .gz, .tar, .bz2, .tar, .zst, .tar, .xy, .tgz, .tbz2, .tzst, and .txz, a lot of them that I've never seen before. So this is what it gives you right now. It's capable of opening these and more to come. Microsoft said that it's a work in progress. File Explorer will have other archives in a future update to the File Explorer that will be added over time. So this is good news. Um, I think it's nice to see that um, even though a lot of reports say it's slower than the original programs that actually do, um, you know, decompress these archives, still, um, I think having the capability of opening them without, you know, having to download software all the time is a great idea. Uh, especially, you know, it will actually remove also some um, problems that could arise from downloading software when you don't know where to actually get it. One of the biggest problems in Windows is there's a lot of websites that try to fake you into and lure you into downloading .rar archive software from a site that isn't the original site. And it's sometimes difficult to see the difference. And a lot of people get actually caught by this. And then you get malware, ransomware, and so on. By having native archive opening in File Explorer, it prevents that. It prevents you from having to go online to get any software, and that's pretty good. So these are the 11 archives that now are added since the last update. More to come, so this is good news, I think. And it's, um, it's a good idea to have a lot of these features included within Windows that prevents you from always having to download third-party software. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.